Hey, uh, here we are. Welcome once again to my Dogamama shenanigans where I pop up looking like the most random dude or creature. And uh, apparently today I decided I'm a hunter, which is pretty theme appropriate considering that the Monster Hunter Wilds trailer just finally dropped. See, it's a funny story. I was just chilling one moment and then I took the wrong corner and BAM! The most beautiful jump scare ever. You telling me I got to see live sand ships return? We not rocking with this guy anymore? Yeah. You telling me we get her as a blacksmith? We really not rocking with this guy anymore? <laughs> you telling me she's our handler now? Not this girl anymore? <laughs> Capcom and romanceable NPCs to the game in my life is yours. <laughs> okay, but seriously, there's only one thing I want to see come from these ships and we all know what that is. What the f- I'm sorry, uh, let me get this on my system. Woo, woo, woo! I couldn't tell you, bro, she's even rocking a Yinku Ku plushie! Wait, you know what this motherfucker kinda look like? Look! Why the fuck is everything just so right just now? Yo, this game is coming out swinging. Now five seconds in the trailer and we get both confirmation of feline and hunter voice acting, bro. Hey, hey, hey this is gonna be great! You bet. Now to lead it away from the pack. We'll make for the desert. Right. I've selected you as a lead hunter for this expedition. Thank you, sir. And it's being sported by the voice actor Todd Habercorn. To my knowledge, he voice acts numerous characters from anime, such as Kid from Soul Eater or Natsu from Fairy Tale. <laughs> I was like, do my ears deceive me? I love paying attention to talent in the voice actor scene and seeing Moss Hunters take it seriously like this is. Man, it's just fucking great. Yo, let's take a detour real quick. Can we talk about how fucking clean our hunter is, bro? Peep the drip, yo. Peep the drip, yo. Look at the main pro tag stare. I'm telling you, the next monster isn't prepared for that ass whooping. <laughs> Look at this shit, bro. That's fucking beautiful. And I, <laughs> we most definitely are going to get back to him. You know, Wilds wasn't playing with that whole hoarding monster mechanic because look at this shit bro look at this they out here hunting for your ass bro when did that ever happen to us you better hide behind those bushes lest your ass want to find out what it's like to be gang affiliated i'll lead it away from the pack we'll make for the desert i'm not even gonna lie suji <clears throat> if you keep showing me these hunters actually talking like this bro you and I are gonna have to fuck. He really turned the slinger into a real slinger. And look at what he did to Buddy in the back. Big bro up front don't even care about homeboy in the back. Yo, I was already crazy for that sandstorm. Still, this shit right here looks straight out of a horror scene. Doesn't even look like a monster on a game. This shit is gorgeous. This shit bring a tear to my eye. This shit bring tears to both my eyes this pit make me want to dive in it this pit make me want to dive in it with his homies no less she looking like a portal to fortnite this shit looking like it's about to summon an elden ring boss she looking like fatalis's butthole bro this shit look like a lot of things to me big bro don't even care about his homies flushing down the toilet because he's gonna go ahead and drag us through this seamless cutscene real quick and speaking on that matter they got the gap posted up with us bro that boy is real Ready. This palico look like I've just brought him through 50 different ass whoopings just to whoop this monster's ass. Jokes aside though, I love it when Monster Hunters prove to me that this is actually my cat. My palicos don't ever get caught lacking or sliding. My cat be like, I'm my perimeter and my perimeter's me and I shall not abandon my post until I'm properly relieved. I clearly didn't bring enough attention to this because just the way they slid us into that gameplay is smooth as Fuck, I can't lie. Now commencing the hunt by order of the guild. And please, please give us more guild and related comments like this. Please let the guild let me attack monsters. Please give me permission. No, don't just sick me at them. Give, give the guild the word or give me the word from the guild to, to go after a monster. I want more of that. Don't attack this monster unless we tell you to, bro. By order of the guild. Yeah, I, I, I'm gonna need some more of that. You're gonna have to give me some more of that. Cause Cause that shit, that shit means something to me. I love the guild related shit, bro. Oh no, they done four scarum golem and devil joe to have a baby, bro. This must have looked like someone I know in real life, bro. Dude, they slapped an amphibian and I started line up. Are you being for real right now? 
I love me some amphibian, bro, for real. I'm all for them popping up. Garam Joe over here is the perfect way to introduce these six gins to Moss Hunters. Two seconds in and god dang. That tongue about to have at least 20% of this community feeling some type of way. They weren't playing around either. Look at the details on that shit. That shit is most definitely his primary attack. This dude about to trap some of y'all in domain expansion. Digital footprint. Boy, they doing anything but teaching y'all how to dolphin dive these days, huh? Yo, not two seconds ago, did I just vouch for you and you out here getting your ass whooped, bro? Come on, bro, lock in. Nah. Really, they tagging him though. These motherfuckers must think this shit is Jujutsu Kaisen. Look at this dude. He really saw them jumping in and went, let me at him. If that's how he rolled up, I wouldn't be surprised if two more popped up. And they really working his ass. Golly, it's really fucked up what they be doing to you, but fuck it, it's your life, bro. Oh, nah, they really had to drive by some Moss Hunters. It's crazy, y'all really fucked with the wrong guy. That boy didn't waste no time. He slugged that shit over and went straight to popping his ass on Mount, no less. It's crazy, we truly can drive by on Moss Hunters now. Motherfuckers about to call this Hood Hunter wild. Oh, nah, we really about to be using new ports for energy, not no fucking files. He said, fuck this shit, I'm about to get to work. Put them hands up right now. Oh, nah, you know he mean business because he took that Dark Souls 3 Artorias great sword weapon art stance you just hit your ass with a shuriken with a great sword you gotta skedaddle you are in danger my guy i don't even know what to say for this clip they out here adding switches to bow guns now motherfucker pulled out a doohickey and attached it to his bow gun that shit crazy this device don't even look off this earth this shit don't even look like it is from this planet Oh, that shit had to hurt. Oh, y'all really let him box y'all now. That's crazy. Oh, he felt every inch of that shit. That shit probably felt like eternal pain. We know he been doing that shit for a minute too because look at the open wounds on his body. That's the equivalent of somebody rubbing their meat all over your face. Yo, me personally, I would not take that level of disrespect. Hey, y'all would just jump on his ass a second ago. That's crazy. Yo, I don't see how you can come back from this game. I did say earlier you were not prepared for that ass whooping, bro. How y'all hunt him? And then he just start hunting, y'all. <laughs> hey, you know who this motherfucker kind of look like? Look! And you got more confirmation on that voice acting. You got my boy Todd putting in some work. For this expedition. Thank you, sir. Damn, man. I didn't think I'd ever see anything like this. A hunter and Moss Hunters having a backstory. Like, what the fuck do you even want me to say, man? I'm already overstimulated. This shit is absolutely insane, bro. Nah, that's crazy. He decided that ass whooping alone wasn't enough. He had to get the homies to partake in. Them boys pulled up quick. They ready for some smoke. They about to use the power of friendship and new ports. They could wait to get their hands on his ass. Do my eyes deceive me? Is this Possible? Nah. Let me close my eyes and open them real quick. That shit's still there. I gotta be, I gotta be fucking tripping, bro, because ain't no way this dude is holding his ass back with a great sword in his jawline, bro. What the fuck? I gotta be sleeping. This shit ain't real. You tell me. I've been around this franchise my whole life. I survived. And I ended up getting to see the day we do this to these motherfuckers. You know, I love this because somehow. Out of everything I've ever seen in Monster Hunters, that is the most realistic thing I've ever seen from a Monster Hunter game. Oh man, this is just so much to think on, bro. I need to give a moment of silence for this clip right here. Like, I, I have no words for this. Like, yo, I'm gonna be for real. Yo, there's some evil ass people working at Capcom because ain't, ain't no way they just showed us this then left us on scene, bro. There ain't no way. There really is no way. Cause this is a toxic ass relationship with y'all. How am I supposed to look at world the same after this? Y'all, y'all put me in a tough spot because now I gotta sleep these next nights feeling alone and helpless. Shit, man. We'll talk about this more in another video, man. But that was my general reaction to this shit, bro. Like, what more can I say, man? They added. Two of the things I wanted the most in Moss Hunters. Voice actor, storytelling, and I'm going to put a third in because I'm a little stupid. But voice acting, storytelling, and most importantly, guild-related shit. And I mean direct involvement. like Not like World when they just kind of were there and present. No, I mean your hunter being directly involved with them. <laughs> I love this, man. I love the play the, the, where this is headed. I love everything.
and this shit. They really don't got our hunters rocking the Gears of War oversized buff bodies anymore, naturally. We, they really slimmed us down and gave us a new anatomy, man. Like, there's a lot to appreciate on this trailer. And let's just stick to leaving it as a reaction for now. Hey, yeah, I'll see y'all around for now. Fly, 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 fly forever. Don't try, can't contest us.